Welcome to a USC Libraries tutorial. In this tutorial, you will learn how to export all citations from a systematic review search in Google Scholar to EndNote software. Please watch the systematic review EndNote workflow video before watching this tutorial. I will be using EndNote software X9 for Mac computers. The software looks a little different on a PC, but includes the same basic features. Run your search in Google Scholar. Google Scholar will retrieve thousands of search results, but you only need to save the first 200 citations. Go to Settings and change the results per page to 20. Scroll through the first 200 results and click the star icon under each of the first 200 citations. The star will change to blue to indicate that it has been saved to your library. As you highlight the star icons under each citation, you will continually have to move to the next page until you highlight the first 200 citations. After you have highlighted the first 200 citations, click My Library on the top right to access the 200 results that you just saved. Google Scholar will only let you export 20 citations at a time, so you will have to export 10 separate files. Double check the settings to make sure that results per page is still set to 20. At the top of the results list, click the box to select the 20 citations on the first page. Click the export icon and choose EndNote. The file will download as a .enw extension file to your computer. Rename the file. Include the name of the database, in this case Google Scholar, the citation range, abbreviated name of the systematic review, and date of the search. Go back to your library in Google Scholar. Now delete the citations that you just downloaded by clicking the trash icon. Now, download the next 20 citations in the same exact manner. Make sure you differentiate between the 10 Google Scholar files by including the specific citation range in the name of each file. So 1 through 20, 21 through 40, 41 through 60, and so on. Save all citation files from your systematic review searches together where you will always be able to access them. Open the All Results EndNote Library for the systematic review. The EndNote Library should be organized by groups for each database. Now you are ready to import the Google citation files into EndNote. Select the Import tool in EndNote and select the file you want to import. In the Mac version of EndNote, click Options to view all the import options. Select EndNote Import as your file type. Make sure to set the Import option to Import All. At this point in the process, you want to save all results. You will create a copy of this EndNote library for deduplication purposes later. Click Import. Do this for all 10 of your Google Scholar citation files. When you are finished importing all the files from Google Scholar, select all of the citations from Google Scholar and move them to the Google Scholar group in your EndNote library. View the other videos in this series for more help using EndNote software for systematic reviews. Please contact a librarian if you have any questions. Thank you for watching this USC Libraries tutorial.